There's the Icelandics. There's where I want to go. Oh my word, I didn't realize there was 100 yards. I thought it was maybe 50 feet. Oh boy. We're really gonna test the skill. This thing's early in the morning. Don't really wanna get the big machine out. This is brushy, so I got the brush blade on. Let's try it. Johnny, do you know where my br brush scythe is? Are you gonna take this with you or eat here? Okay. And the cheese. Did you want cheese? I thought you just wanted peanut butter. Cheese too? Yeah. Cheese. There was something wrong with that bird in the process. So well, let's cook it. Let's cook. Let's cook it for the pigs. They're gonna like it better that way. We didn't have enough food scraps, so we went to the freezer to get scraps from our chicken butchering. That's just straight up guts. Let's put in our, what well, we do have of scraps. An old melon, some apples. What happened? Dad. Just the regular, okay. Go put it in the swill, please. Do you want me to go put it in the soup? Yeah, put it in there. Good. They'll like it better if cooked. And by the way, I'm not an experienced cider. I see you guys fell. Did you even see that? I got a few feet. It actually wasn't that bad. Dare I say this is pleasurable? I'm making it. I'm almost halfway there. Just a few minutes, oh my gosh. This is kind of fun. The quiet, the the bit of a lighter workout. Starting to worry about my angle here, like right here. Am I really gonna be able to get the chick shot through here? That's gonna be tough, okay. I'm realizing this is not the tough job. It's gonna be the chick shaw. Now, can I fit through there? I think I can. You know, I'm a little nervous to mow this. On the mower, it's a little difficult. Sometimes it gets rain, it's a little steep. You know, could I come out here? 20 minutes of the morning, get a nice little quiet rhythm workout. I am most pleasantly surprised about this thing. I thought this was gonna be drudgery. I wonder if I should've went uphill. No, I think I did it right. Should I swing uphill? No, I feel like swinging downhill was better. Okay, this is an Austrian style, European style scythe. It's super light. It's from Scythe Supply Company. Uh, you probably recognize it from Jim Kovaleski. That's where I was introduced to it up in Maine. Now I'm a hired side. I get, you know, the seedlings I'm gonna pick up this week, a friend of mine who has the greenhouse, I mow her fence lines and she does the seedlings for me. So He collects gra grass clippings with this thing to fertilize and mulch his garden. Now I don't remember it being that easy in Maine. When it, oh, I guess when I ordered my own, you give them your own dimensions. And so this is a custom fit to me. It just feels great. Guys, this is like my <laughs> second time scything. And I ju just cleared a path. I just cleared a hundred yard path through this stuff. I'm just blown away in like less than 10 minutes. All right, you guys ready for the move? I've got my three nets over there. I'm about to move the chick shaw. Mr. Brown is calling. And so, give me one second, because I want to try, let's see what else this scythe will cut. Oh yeah, and look, I haven't been able to mow in here, because it's so boggy and steep. That scythe would totally get that. Come on.
What do you need? I want to go with you. Okay, good. Let's go. <laughs> Shoot, Mr. Brown, I just remembered while I'm down here, let's turn off the pig swill. I'm sure it's cooked. It needs to start cooling off now. You want to race? <laughs> oh, I'm barely keeping ahead of him. Oh, I think long distance he might have you. Oh, buddy. It's boiling. Leave the lid off that. Let it cool. Let's go back up, Mr. Brown. Hey, I'm glad you guys came. You can help me carry some of this stuff. Lily, will you carry the strap? Thank you. Man, I'm inspired by that blade. You just don't understand by that sign. I'm thinking, I need to start my morning workouts again. Broad fork, between broad forking and scything, 20, 30 minutes a day. Get a nice workout and get something done at the same time. You guys getting through there all right? Yeah. You like my path of mode? I, I got, I, I kissed on two times on my foot. It's all ready, Ninos. Okay, now for the fun part, get loose. I'm coming for you guys, but first, I got to. I got to, so I couldn't mow this because it's too steep right there. I was afraid I would topple the mower. Oh my gosh, you got to be kidding me. Weed tree, that thick. You think I can get it, Lily? Yeah. Let's try, ready? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. I, well, I think the handle needs to be glued on, but look at that. That's crazy! Woo! I have to get the ices out, but I think I've got a new workout. Gosh, I could have finished that in like three minutes. Maybe I'm delaying moving this chick show, I don't know. Alright. Yeah. So light, too. Good deal. Here we are. We made it. Ready? Rebecca, good morning. Good morning. Happy anniversary. <laughs> you happy? <laughs> I beat you to it. No, I already, I beat, I you already to beat, it. I beat him to it this morning. I beat you to it. Well, I remembered last night. And I was yeah. laughing. I was like, oh my goodness, tomorrow's our anniversary. I was like, I guess we don't have any gifts for each other. <laughs> We're not the date of people anyway. No. So we're gonna do something. When things slow down a little bit, let's have a date. We're gonna do that. Okay, we're going on a special date. Yes. Um, a fun that, date. That scythe is blowing my mind. It's absolutely amazing. Really? You can't stop me. Like I wanna go out there right now. You can't stop. I know it's milking stop. time, but I'm gonna go scythe some more. Can't stop, won't stop. Yeah, I'm gonna show I'm gonna see what this thing'll do. Alright. It's milking time. Let's put it off a little bit. Let's we've still gotta feed the pig port pigs. Hey, does anybody want to ride in the wheelbarrow? First things first, let's check on Mama's pumpkins and get some of that garden veggies Woo. for the pigs while we're over there. Yeah. Papa, do we like with the garden veggies? Ah. This is a patch of cover crops in a garden and overgrown lettuce. Let's get that. Let's get that. But just in a second, let's see if Mom's pumpkins get through. Show enough, pumpkins. We need to come out here and, uh, oh, that's, that's, uh, that's Swiss chart. There you go. So we'll thin it and save those pumpkins. So we can harvest, we can, so we can cut where a mower can't cut. What about harvesting cover crops and garden produce? Not gonna be any problem. <laughs> Absolutely no problem. Whatsoever. All right, come on, kids, come grab this. Wow, that's easier than just pulling it individually. I like it. So, how about fresh greens for the chickens? Fresh greens. <laughs> So what about trimming like this stuff right here? Oh my gosh. Look, you don't have to have a momentum. Shh, pigs love this lamb's quarter. 
they're waiting on the they're waiting on the scam and the uh, the swill I guarantee you look at this row right here encroaching on the garden you can mow away from the garden Are you serious this is so pleasurable and it's even mowing through stubby stuff like that The question is, what about that stuff? What about that gnarly stuff? Let's do that in a second, but I think the pigs have, I wanna get a shot of the pigs eating the greens. They're a little spoiled with skim milk and swill. Let's see if we can't knock this out. I think it'd be better to swing down. I bet I found the limit. I found the limit to my rubber boots. What? What? Really? It's like there's no limit on this thing. That's crazy. I need to come back with gloves. Look, get this off of here. Look, I can't stop. I can't stop. Get these briars. Away from here. Alright, that's it. Let's put this one up. One more demo on that. Let's try just some fine grass. But first, let's get these pigs their swill and skim. It could cool off more when I pour it into the skim milk. All right, fresh swill. Chickens have destroyed that lettuce. Yay! I did it perfect. It's not too high. All right, change the diaper. Washed all the buckets off. Look, they love it. You guys love that. Okay, let's try one more thing. This is the grass blade on that. I had the brush blade. Let's say we want to mow this. I don't know, six, nine inches high. This is good looking grass right there. Let's see what happens. Oh my. I'm in love. Oh my. Wow, getting close to this tarp. Love it. I thought I'd have to sling this thing to get it to cut. You just move it along, look. Look how close I can get to this tarp. That'd be hard to do with the string trimmer without hurting this tarp. Look at this, look at that. And this, this, I need to sharpen this blade a little bit too. Wow. This is no joke, I'm for real. Today we have use for these grass clippings. Feed for the soil. As mulch. Our eggs. Our broth. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers to 18 and there's years. There's pork in there too. Oh, it's our pork too. Mm -hmm. 18 years of marriage. Cheers. Happy marriage. Well, you think we're bringing the arsenal? Going to help Ben and Megan Holler break in their homestead, get some stuff done. Brand new homestead, a lot of work to be done. But I think we have the tools for the job. <laughs> tomorrow, all day, tomorrow, it's gonna be good. A lot of folks you guys have grown to know and love. A lot of North Carolina YouTubers are gonna be there. What? <laughs> what did you catch? I found it in the woods. I'll go get a bucket. Go get a bucket, Lily, quick. The frog. What are you gonna do with it in a bucket? What are you gonna do with it in a bucket? I'm gonna watch it dump. See, and if you dump it, put some water in there. Yeah. I'll go get some water. Don't, don't let Laurel get it. <laughs> no, 